Hey knitters, it's Wednesday. Look at my kitten. He's so cute and ginger. And he really doesn't want to be in this video. <sighs> okay, so Amber and Jenny didn't make videos this week, and I'm assuming that's because it's New Year's and the holiday and stuff, and then I'm pretty sure that Michael's not making a video this week because he's in Florida. So I don't know if Meir is making a video, I might be the only one. Happy New Year, guys. But I thought um, for the theme this week, we'll do a 2012 nerdy survey um, because on the Harry Potter Alliance on their YouTube channel, um, Lauren did, posted a survey of like the best nerdy memories of 2012. And I thought this survey is really cool. There's a cat making noises over there. So I'm going to answer the 12 questions and I'll put the link to the video of Lauren from the Harry Potter Alliance if you want to watch her video. And then also the questions will be in the description in case you want to answer them in comments or make a video response. So I'm going to try and answer these really quick so this video isn't too long. All right, let's go. What fandoms did you fall into this year? Downton Abbey. What new internet slang did you learn? YOLO and Ermagerd. What was the best movie you saw? I was really too busy with graduate school to see any movies. I think the only movie that I saw in theaters in 2012 was The Hunger Games. Um, and then other, like outside of theater, I couldn't really tell you. I have no idea. Favorite character you met this year? I don't really know what this question means. How do you meet a character? Um, I met like the Green Goblin when I went to Universal Studios. Um, does that count? I don't know. Favorite meme? Ermacard! It's it's so stupid, but I love it. And then I also, um, the last few weeks, I really got into Grumpy Cat. He's pretty hilarious. Most nerdy item you acquired? This would probably have to be my McGonagall wand that I got from the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. And I'm going to show you, I put my wands in like a little display case. And even though I got the display case after the New Year, so I don't think that counts. But um, it's still really cool, so I'm going to show you. McGonagall's the one in the middle. And then Luna is the brown one and Sirius's is, is the black one. Favorite new food you tried this year? This one I really don't know either. I've had to try a lot of new foods in the past few weeks because of the whole gluten-free thing, but I don't know that I would call those like my favorite food of the whole year. Um, I tried pumpkin gelato, like pumpkin pie gelato um, at Whole Foods, and that was really good. That was before I was gluten-free. I don't know. Sorry. What was the best book you read? The Fault in Our Stars by John Green. <laughs> Look, it's a poster. Favorite YouTube channel you subscribe to this year? I think I'm going to have to go with Crash Course World History. What is your favorite memory of 2012? Um, definitely would have to be my trip to Colorado. That whole week was just an awesome adventure. What are you looking forward to in 2013? Starting my job on Monday, I think. Um, and just like being a real teacher and not being in school and getting to make more of my own decisions and do what I want <laughs> instead of having to worry about papers to write and textbooks to read. <laughs> what is the GIF that best describes 2012 for you? I don't have fancy editing software so I can't like put it in the corner and show you um, but I think the GIF that best describes 2012 would probably be um, the it's a gif of Kurt from Glee, and he's twirling, and like there's a little caption that says emotional twirling. That was That's probably the best description of my year. I had a very, you know, with graduate school and being really stressed out and lots of changes, it, you know, was emotional in like in a good and a bad way. So I think that that gif is pretty accurate. I think that's the only thing that I'm going to talk about in this video is the survey because um, I don't want this video to be too long and I've had to like stop and start again because the cat is being loud and crazy. Hey, the knitters don't want to see your butt, cat. So I hope that everyone had a good new year. <laughs> I hope that everyone had a good new year and I will see Miira tomorrow. Bye. Say bye, kitty. Meow. Ha <laughs> ha.